my name is John Ganji. Um, I teach Diploma Economics as well as uh, Individuals and Societies. Um, as, on top of that, I am the uh, MYP Services Action Coordinator um, and I work with several service groups including Fairness Coffee, uh, Mixed Up, Charity Concert and Rescue Glass. Prior to coming to, um, to NIST, I had um, explored uh, uh, social enterprise with different um, with student groups at my previous schools um, and uh, I knew they were keen on um, exploring uh, social enterprise and uh, upon uh, coming here I had conversations about really kind of taking social enterprise to the next level. Um, it ended up with me kind of really working with students and developing uh, Fairness, Pro uh, Fairness Coffee which is um, student-led uh, social enterprise that uh, works with local farmers to bring coffee to, to NIST, um, but yet giving back to the community through um, really kind of a fair trade-like uh, arrangement. NIST has offered um, all sorts of um, possibilities for kind of taking um, my own learning to new levels, um, as well as kind of my, my uh, opportunities for um, exploring leadership, um, I became the MYP Service Action Coordinator, um, the first time being a coordinator, which is very exciting, kind of really um, giving an opportunity to develop the program uh, and, and working with others and really just making um, this uh, service program that much better. Uh, so when I first arrived in NIST um, five years ago, uh, my wife and I lived in RE, which is um, several B, uh, BTS stops away from uh, the school. So it's really outside of kind of the, the city center and outside of kind of the, the NIST bubble. Since then, uh, we've had a, a, a baby boy. Um, he's now nine months old, but in, in, in planning for all that, we thought, you know, maybe um, looking into a house. So we actually bought a, a, a townhouse. My wife is Thai, so I didn't have that option, but townhouses are, um, offer a lot more space. Um, they are available. Um, and, and they do offer just a, a whole uh, different way of life here. One of the things I love about uh, being here in Bangkok is, is the food. Um, for a foodie, uh, there's just endless options uh, from your cheap uh, local kind of street food vendors all the way on up to kind of fine dining at really kind of um, uh, prices that work. Um, so yeah, it's, it's great uh, to really have all that. In terms of what I do outside school, there's all sorts of different opportunities. Um, I love working out. Uh, I actually got into CrossFit while I've been here. Um, there's lots of CrossFit gyms. There's one actually not too far from school. Um, and so I go there several times a week. Great community of people. So yeah, and, and the, the, the gym is uh, really a kind of a five minute, uh, quick little boat ride on the Klong. We'll walk over to the uh, to the facility, uh, which just makes it really easy for me um, day to day to get to the gym. I play in an international softball league, which is really cool. Um, yeah, there's lots of things to, to kind of, in terms of the outdoors, lots of places obviously to travel, whether it be the mountains, whether it be the, 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 um, the beaches and the islands, um, lots of green spaces, um, both in and out of Bangkok. We, uh, my family and I like to go to the parks here. They're all over the place uh, and again have lots of things on offer. Um, every now and then I'll go out and play some hoops and pick up ball or um, you know we'll just go and have a walk, stroll through the around the lake or whatever it is but um, there's always something uh, I think for everyone here at, 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 at NIST and in Bangkok. <laughs>